YouTuber Jack Doherty is going viral after crashing his expensive car while live streaming. The 20 year old social media star crashed his $200,000 McLaren while live streaming on the platform Kick October 5th. Jack's cameraman Michael filmed Jack driving down a Miami highway from the passenger seat as it rained. After the footage briefly turns black, Jack is heard asking his pal if he's okay before instructing him to continue filming the aftermath of the incident. No one else was injured in the crash. Hello and welcome back to today's video. I hope you're having a fantastic day. Jack Doherty has done it again, guys. I didn't actually think this guy could figure out a way to be more hated on the internet, but here we are. Jack crashed his incredibly expensive McLaren that looks like my shirt, and this video was unexpected for me, so I didn't know what shirt to wear. I thought, hey, let me pick the shirt that looks closest to his McLaren. But this video today is less about how he crashed his McLaren and totaled it, and more about the fact that he's a complete and total sociopath who cared more about his car than he did his bleeding friend in the passenger seat. Anybody who's seen any Jack content knows he's full of himself. He makes some of the biggest brain rot content on the platform. People have been calling for him to be banned off of YouTube for a very long time now. And no pun intended, he was just kicked off of Kick as they banned him just recently. And I even made a video that had Jack Doherty in it on January 1st of 2024 talking about cringy YouTubers. But I was even unaware of how full of himself Jack was after doing a bunch of research in his videos and making that video. I just thought I was making a fun video about cringy YouTubers. Incredibly ironically, in that video that I made about Jack, he was getting pulled over over for driving incredibly fast. If you don't know what I mean, let's go ahead and check it out. We got pulled over. No way. Like what speed was I going? Well, the speed limit on Sunset's 35. How fast do you think you were going? I don't know. Maybe like 50. 85. Yeah, I don't know. 85. I don't think I went 85. I don't think so. That's the next step is for you to hand me the key. I'm trying. We'll go for it. <laughs> Uh, yeah, so what's happening? You're gonna be arrested for reckless driving? You know the Island Boys? Never heard of them. He kisses them on OnlyFans. Alright, alright, we don't have to say I kiss them. It's, it's amazing how much you guys think this is a big joke. Oh, we're not trying to make it a joke. And ironically, in the video that I made about Jack Doherty, the video we were talking about was him getting pulled over for going way too fast in a Lamborghini, and the cop was scolding him about how dangerous that is and how he could get someone else killed or get himself killed. But first, whether you know who Jack Doherty is or not, let's go ahead and take a look at the crash footage to see just how bad it really is. Open the door, open the door, open your door. We're locked in here. Help. 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 Oh, shit. Oh. Help. 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 Oh. Oh. Help. Can you hold this? Oh, running. Oh. No, my fucking car, bro. Vamos, baby. Vamos. Oh, my, my poor friend is declaring. Oh, dude. My car. No. I've been in three car accidents before, so I'm aware, like, it's not fun at all, it's a shocking experience, and it's traumatizing sometimes. And look, we get it, Jack's car is totaled, it's completely gone. So I get being upset about your car being damaged. But there's one thing he hasn't really been worried about this entire accident. Oh right, it was his friend who's in the passenger seat, he doesn't care at all about that guy. No! Mike, are you good? Oh shit. But it's clear for about a whole minute after he got out of the car, he forgot his friend even existed. His friend's bleeding down the side of his face, he's holding his arm like he's hurt, and all Jack has to say is, hey yo bro, you good? You good man? I can keep filming, right? Put your phone down and make sure your friend's okay. After the car accident, Jack starts asking Michael to keep filming for him. Like, my head's bleeding bro, can I stop for a second? And you can really tell that he doesn't care about any of his friends when he starts asking them all to keep filming once they arrive. Get out of the car. I want to take if he doesn't have to. The one sensible friend here is like, hey Michael, you don't have to record, you're injured. And then Jack immediately goes, no Michael, you take this phone and keep filming. His own friend was even like, hey, let this guy have a break for a second. This Jack dude is so full of himself, he doesn't care about anybody but himself. Jack has three priorities in life, and it's me, myself, and I. Bro, I, I, I was, I oh God, can you film, can you film on here on the phone? And yeah. you can leave, come. Make it look good, look through here the whole time. Go over Michael is. Bro, as soon as I found out about the accident, I rushed right over. Hey, bro, can you film? Can you take the phone here? Can you film? You get this angle here. You're gonna get this angle here, Michael. I know you're bleeding from your head, but I'm gonna need you to keep filming me right here. Be sure you stay on my face. Stay right here while I'm on my face. Be sure you get my good side. My head hurts, boss. Don't whine and complain. You've only lost a pint of blood. Wait, just a sec, just a sec. Now do I look better? Is this my good side? Don't stop rolling. You look really good, dude. Good, keep going. Can you guys just hold off a little bit? You're hurt. Yeah. Sure, yeah. I, that's what I was saying. The paramedic comes over and is like, you stop filming, you're clearly hurt. You need some medical attention over here. And Michael's just standing there like, I think that idea might be the best idea. Well, baby, I just want you to perform my 21st birthday party. Please, 
baby, little baby. Yeah, I know. He just, yeah, I'm sorry. He just keeps asking me to be here. Jack's over here asking little baby to come to his 21st birthday party, and his friend here clearly doesn't want to be filming him. I'm sorry. He just keeps making me film here. I don't know why. I don't even want to be here. Like that is so incredibly awkward and cringy, man. But you know, this is Jack Doherty we're talking about. So immediately he's like, "How can I make money off of this situation?" And if you thought people already didn't like Jack, oh man, people really don't like Jack now. All right. So as you can see on his channel, one day ago he posts, I crashed my McLaren. I did not think this was gonna be happening today. Me neither. Guys, my McLaren is totaled a couple days before my 21st birthday. No, my McLaren, no! What am I gonna do without this McLaren? I got no McLaren. I don't know where my shirt went. So as you gaze into Jack's armpit, let me just pose the question to you. Why is he shirtless? Look, I get that it's raining. I get it. And his shirt got wet. People's shirts get wet in the rain. But everyone else out here has their clothes on. And you just like... Don't. There's only one thought in that head. How can I monetize my life and my friends and family in order to make money for myself? Dude, no one cares that it's almost your 21st birthday. For my 21st birthday, I went to a Buffalo Wild Wings and had so many shots with all of my friends. Actually, it was too many shots. <laughs> and I barely had enough money to pay for those. Nobody cares that you crashed your McLaren and you're just gonna be driving your Lamborghini tomorrow. I don't know how to feel right now, guys. I'm just so... I'm sad, bro. I'm so sad right now. Sadness pays me express how sad I actually am. At least my Richard Mills is still okay. Just kidding. Oh, dude, yeah, you're so sad. You're so sad right now. Honestly, I could tell how sad you are by all the tears you're crying and all the genuine emotion you're showing. <laughs> He's literally trying to walk into the shot so he can pose for the shot to then put it in his video. All right, all right, they're moving the car now. They're moving the car now. All right, I'm getting position. Thank you, guys. What are they trying to film like a documentary about his car crash here? Why was he walking dramatically back in the rain? This isn't a movie, Jack. So after our epic unnecessarily shirtless walk in the rain, we now have gone to the hospital where we can still not stop filming. That was so scary. It smoked up so fast. Like, how did that happen? Bro, if you think if I had a full tank of gas, like, we would have been exploded. Dude, do you think if we had a full tank of gas, we might have just, like, completely blown up? His friend's over here like, I'm just happy to be alive. And then Jack's over here filming like, dude, oh my goodness, dude, do you think if, like, we had a full tank of gas, we might have just completely blown to smithereens and you and I would both be dead right now? Dude? And then also on top of that, we don't, we crashed, like, 42 miles per hour. I know, it was, we weren't even going fast. At all. Like, if we were going, what, double the speed, we probably would have been dead. I don't believe one bit on the freeway that they were going 42 miles miles per hour. I don't know what house this is exactly, but now we're headed to a place where his mom is located so that we can traumatize her and film it for clout as well. I don't want to be on the picture. Uh. His mom is already saying that she doesn't want to be filmed, but that's definitely going to be disrespected and not listened to at all as they continue filming the entire time. Are you okay? So, you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. I'm just, I'm just, I don't like to cry. Well, honey, I better cry now. You need to stop. I'm gonna remind you guys, this is the video on Jack's own channel. Don't go watch it. Don't give him views for this. His mom is begging him to stop doing what he's doing. And I think she means just in general, the whole YouTube thing, the way that he's reckless with everything, the way that he lives his life. I think she's begging him to stop because she doesn't want to see her son literally die. You are lucky you are alive, Jack. Why are we filming any of this? <laughs> this feels like this shouldn't be filmed at all. This, this feels like this shouldn't be on YouTube. This girl in the back named McKinley who's in a lot of his videos, she's crying. His mom's crying in front of him. Let's see how he reacts to the people he cares about being really sad and crying for him. Let me hear you, my love. Aww, thank uh, you, sweetheart. Thank God McKinley's okay. You should go on your knees, Jack, and say thank I you. I know. Thank God that we're both okay. He seems so unthankful for anything. So ungrateful for anything. It's almost disgusting to watch this. I can't watch somebody be like this and not feel a little bit like sick to my stomach watching someone with all of this stuff acting like this everyone's so quick to put some shit on shit on me on social media no one's gone through what i gone through just now like I no dumber words have ever been spoken than these words right here sorry guys i needed to take a break there because this guy just said that nobody's been through anything like he's been through look everyone at the walking baby complaining about how his life is so hard i crashed my two hundred thousand dollar mclaren my life is so hard i could have died everyone always says i'm such a bad person on social 
social media. You know what, Jack? You're right. Probably nobody has ever almost crashed in a $200,000 McLaren and died because most people don't own a McLaren. We don't have enough money for that. What's one way to make your audience hate you? Tell them that you've had it harder than they've had it. But I guarantee you that 99.9% .9 of Jack's viewers have it worse than him. And for him to say something like this is incredibly tone deaf, it's incredibly brain dead. This guy's never played football, but he may have CTE. I'm, like, I literally almost died and I'm like, fuck these cars too. At least I still got two Lambos. <laughs> no, okay. I'm ready to start going again. Uh, give me my keys. I realize I still got my McLaren key, so I still have all my keys. Uh, let me take a pic with all my keys real quick. So people still think I have a McLaren. <laughs> Oh, I'm just happy to be alive, guys. I literally was crying on the way home. Hey, man, I'm still happy. I got all my keys. I still got my McLaren. Hey, yo, let's go out in the Lambo right now. Why not? Let's go out there and get it out on these rainy roads. You know what I'm saying? I got I got all my keys, baby. No, but for real, though, I was, like, really sad on the way home. I, like, cried, and I was, like, really sad. I, I really, um, I'm really, uh beaten up by this and uh, I've have it I have it so much harder than all of you at home like my life is very hard as you can see by the gigantic mansion behind me hey yo let's go take that Lambo outside though you know what I'm saying I feel like I become less intelligent every single time I'm watching one of his videos there's never anything I learn I just get angry or sad he's the worst influencer on this platform Jack Doherty is easily like the worst influencer on this platform and it's not even close if you think I'm upset about this take a look at the comments on his video heartbreaking news Jack Doherty found alive after his car crash at the age of 20. You're seriously still trying to milk this? Dude, you are absolutely cooked. I hope you get jail time for this and your friends sue you for everything you own. Why did you upload this? Bro showing us all the evidence just for views. Dude can't even put the camera down for two seconds. I feel so bad for the car plus the cameraman. I saw so many worse comments yesterday that had thousands and thousands of likes which clearly have been taken down by Jack or a member of his team. People were absolutely going in on him on the comments talking about what a sociopath he is, how Michael the cameraman who was injured should sue him for putting him in so much danger, how he doesn't care about anyone but himself, how he's exploiting his mom's grief for money, and going through all those comments, I don't think I found a single positive comment for a long time. I scrolled quite a bit down. Maybe Jack has officially become the most hated YouTuber on the platform. I personally think that more could be happening from this situation. I feel like someone could sue him. I don't think the insurance is going to pay for his car because he literally filmed himself committing a crime on camera. He's literally filming himself on live stream texting and driving and then crashing the car. I don't think insurance is going to pay for that. Also, he could get in big trouble for this. Like, there's a lot more that's gonna be happening from this situation that hasn't happened yet, but it's just crazy. So I thought I had to make an emergency video today to talk to you guys in my finest paint splattered shirt, just like Jack Doherty splattered McLaren. I really appreciate you guys watching today's video and I hope you enjoyed it. If you do enjoy comedic commentary videos like what I make on my channel, please hit that subscribe button because I will be posting regularly. That's all I have here today, but at the bottom of the video here, you'll see another video that you could maybe watch because the algorithm thinks that you're gonna enjoy it. My name is Ryan Askew, reminding you to stay askew because being normal is boring. All I have left to say is bye-bye.